happy to be back as well. And uh, it, it's a little bit awkward for me to testify right now because it is the New Year, it's somewhat of a special service and whatnot. Um, and I don't want to make this at all about me. But as most of you know, I had twins. And <laughs> I have to testify and thank God publicly because it's just the most incredible thing I've ever seen. It's absolutely awesome what God is doing in my life, what He's done in my life. Uh, since I came to God, um, you know, I was divorced and I never thought I would ever get remarried again. I, the last thing on my mind was dealing with a woman. I, I apologize. <laughs> but God not only gave me a woman, He gave me the most beautiful woman in the entire world. And now God gave me two of the most beautiful girls I've ever seen. I've never seen girls so beautiful. Not because they're mine. Trust me, not because they're mine. They are gorgeous. I just, I want you all to know that they are healthy. I know Louis testified the other day and said that, uh, uh, Charlotte is on a monitor, but it's it's really no big deal. I don't want to go into any details. It's really because they were just born at 36 weeks. At 36 weeks, they're not premature, but they are considered preterm. So the doctor doesn't want us bringing them anywhere out in public or anything until they have all their shots, just to let you know. I'm desperate for everybody to see them. Because so um, if I'm sounding a little bit incoherent, Please, I, I apologize. I'm running on so little sleep, you can't even imagine. But, you know, I have my oldest son, Louis, 18, and Fernie's uh, only 14 months younger than him. And boy, that was really, really tough. I remember that clearly. You can never imagine how hard it is to have two infants at the same time. You, you just can't. But Catherine's doing an amazing job, and God is helping us to deal with it. Uh, her sister's been helping us, her mom's been helping us, and it's just, it's such a beautiful thing to see how God supplies, like we were just Amen. saying. And I'm sorry, brother, I don't mean to go against you, but he does give you everything. Uh -huh. Everything. Because if what he doesn't give you, you don't need it. Uh -huh. Because I have everything I could ever want. Everything. This was an awesome year. It was a tough year as well. A lot of times, you know, people tell me that I wear my, my emotions on my face, and, and I try really hard to hide it. It's been a tough year for me in so many ways. Most of you know when I testify, I don't bring up my problems. I don't like to talk about my problems. I'm talking right now about the glory of God, how beautiful, how awesome he is. How much he's given me. It's so great to see Louis following God. It's such a challenge to me personally because, you know, I live so long outside of the will of God that I have so much baggage that I have to deal with. It really blesses me to be able to yes. see my son taking yes. this up right. so early in life. Amen. It's so amen. 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 I'm just so grateful to God. I mean, yeah, I feel honestly like I should just go stand up there and we'll put that down and I'll give you guys a slideshow. Because it's, <laughs> it's just so beautiful to see these babies being born. Amen. I mean, it, it's just amazing to me. I really have no words to thank God for what he's done in my life. Um, the girls are doing great. Catherine is doing great. She's desperate to come here, as you can imagine. Uh, we haven't been here now because we don't want to. It's really tough. I mean, yeah, so, but the babies are fine. And once uh, Catherine's able to drive now, so I think what we're going to be doing, just to let you all know, we're going to be alternating. So you might see me or you might see her because one of us obviously needs to be with the babies in the meantime. But again, I just want everybody to know that we're so grateful for everybody's support, for their prayers, most importantly. Um, I'm not one to think that, you know, oh, because I prayed to God, this happened or that. I believe firmly that it's not only my prayers, but the prayers of the saints and the prayers of the children of God. If not, what's the point of, of asking for prayer? It's that unified prayer that really reaches me. Amen, God. amen. These children are an absolute blessing to me. I'm 43 yeah. years old and I'm starting over again and it's the best feeling ever. I'm the happiest guy in town, I'm telling you. <laughs> and, and I know I'm rambling on, but they're just, I really, I wish there was something I could give to God that, that would really just show him how grateful, how thankful I am. He saved my soul. He's given me the most awesome life. I, mean, I just, I, what do you say to something like that? Amen. Amen. Really no words. Amen. 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 I'm so Amen. thankful to be here today with the Praise saints the Lord. of God. The family that I have here, a lot of times I get criticized uh, by my family in the flesh that, you know, I'm sure you've all heard it. Oh, you put the church ahead of us. And I say, yeah, you're absolutely right. Yeah, you put the church ahead of you. Because the church, and, and I'm talking about the individuals that, you know, make up this congregation, have shown me so much love in the tough times, in, in the good times. 
they've always been there. Yes. And, 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 I, and even though I feel somewhat, you know, a debt of gratitude in a way, I don't want that to ever be confused. That's not the reason I'm here. I'm not here because everybody's been so nice to me. I'm here because of Jesus. Amen. This isn't a club for me. This is not. I love Jesus Christ. I amen. Love amen. Every time I think about the sacrifice He made on the cross for me, while I was out there doing all these terrible That's things, right. I just, I just can't believe that that was me doing that. And now all of a sudden, I can see, I can live a good, pure, happy life. And I'm just, I'm the most blessed guy in town. I'm happy, happy, happy. Praise God. Praise the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Va a ser un poco difícil uh, tratar de traducir todo eso, pero básicamente el hermano está muy contento, como podemos ver eh, en esta mañana, por lo que Dios ha hecho en su vida en darle estas dos niñas. Eh, él dice que son uh, las más bellas que él ha visto en su vida y 